Yeah. A tea, baby. I'm just trying to tell you I care about you. You care about yourself. I need someone real in my life. We wasted years on this bullshit, and you still the same. I want a family. I need some security in my life. Goodbye, Franklin. All right, guys. So welcome back. Today we return with another episode of Grand Theft Auto 5. So today we find ourselves in front of Franklin's house in the middle of the hood. <laughs> and um, I just booted up the game and it brought me here. I know we're supposed to be playing with Michael right now because the missions that we have are actually Michael missions. So we're going to go over here and we're going to go over to Michael. Today is going to be a really fun episode because today we're going to go and do the heist, which I know that there's different ways to tackle the heist for more money and stuff like that. Um, but I've honestly never really gone that route. I've just kind of gone with my shitty characters and probably made minimum wage. <laughs> How you doing, man? But anyhow, here we go. We got to go to our house, I think, to change clothes. I don't know why it's not. Uh... Where's my car anyways? Oh, God. Don't touch me. <laughs> Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Not you, the Dieter Sachs door what? detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. Oh God, look at that. My slutty wife wants me to oh, help her. Oh, now you want me. All right, I'm coming. The one we should call call is for real policemen. You worthless turd. Let's all remain calm. All right, well, my wife needs my help. What can I do? No, I gotta go help her, right? <gasps> Didn't bring my car, apparently. I'm kind of rich, but I got here on foot. So what, what, what do I do? I just steal somebody else's car. <laughs> and that, my friends, is a secret to staying rich, okay? <laughs> Gas is quite expensive nowadays. Right, here we go. Oh, God. Here we go. I said get off me, you stupid bastard. I told you she's a biter. Can you please step back, sir? That's assault on top of the shoplifting beat. Man, the paperwork. What you packing? You know, standard LSPD issue 9 mil. Sweet. I gotta get some hardware. I'm trying to do police work here. Sweet. I'm gonna take her into booking. Well, what, the <laughs> what is happening? I don't know if I've done this one. What? What just happened? Oh my God! Okay, I'm an idiot. He's got my car. Go, 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 go! Oh, that's hilarious. I know what I'm doing. That's fucking hilarious. Man, I got this. I don't know if I remember stealing the cop car. I remember going to the cafeteria and she was like in some sort of confrontation. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> that is awesome. I I probably done this mission. I just don't don't remember obviously. I have terrible memory. What can I say? Oh my goodness. That is so epic. It's under control. Can, can we just take it to the house? Relax, I got this. Is that it? There we go. Are they gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Bro, have I done this mission before? Don't say it. What? That I have everything I want, so why am I stealing? Oh, my lips I probably are have. sealed. Because if you say that, I'll say the same to you. I'm not saying anything. I'm just doing my best to keep us out of jail. Can we drive home, please? I mean, who are you to judge me? Oh, I'm not judging? No, not at all. You're loving this, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Risking prison, getting shot at, love, love, big love. Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah, thank you. Bro, how fucking hilarious is that? 
Well, you know what? It's staying in the driveway, sweetheart. Okay? It's staying in the damn driveway. Because I said so. All right, here we go. So we got to go over to Lester's now. Man, that was hilarious. That was fucking hilarious. And here we have uh, another side mission there. Okay, let's go to Lester's. Let's tackle the big boy missions here. Dude, that was so freaking hilarious. Michael, might be a good time to start uh, making some moves on the stock market. Uh, man, have you seen the stock market lately? It is tanking. No. We are going into the, to a bear recession right now. Absolutely not. Matter of fact, that might be the best time to buy into the stock market. But hey, who am I? Who's this? Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. Oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do is your business, bro. Anyway, yeah. Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Oh, get out the fucking way. Hey, look at that. I just saved your life, lady. You saw that? That's right. Anyways, we got this nerd uh, now unlocked. I think we use him for the heist. Yeah. That was fucking awesome. there we are almost there I still can't believe I failed that freaking mission bro oh my goodness at the beginning with the cop car I feel so stupid but we're in business we're still in business here we go our now bros the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. Has it been yet? Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. No, oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico and buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're going to need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The jewelers is on Little Portola. All right. Go to Rockford Hills. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. For starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except 
for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lest, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. For sure. All right. <laughs> Press uh, right on the D-back to enter. Hitting Three glasses meeting. camera. Mm -hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. What was the other one, right? Yeah. Well, I don't know what we're gonna do. I suppose so. Well, thank sir, you, sir. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Ah, okay, that's their alarm. Can you get me an air vent in one of the cameras? Alright, one of the cameras. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around. Think about it. Come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. <laughs> what a guy. You got Dude. it. What a guy. Fine. That was what it was, but you're not done taking photographs. So uh, that's the cameras and the alarm. When you've got a shot of the vents, we're done. Great. You got the security camera and the ventilation in that shot. Come back to me. Excuse me, sir. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Totally. Alright, where's the ladder at? Is it out here? Some fucking manners would be nice. Oh, I have to get in the car to get there. Okay. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Yo, what are you doing, man? Leave it to me to get stuck behind a damn truck. I'm just gonna go around this guy. Dude, I love those palm trees, Look, man. There, some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. Here we go. Get to the rooftop. You asked if my watch was a go? I'm saying you never So you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? Hmm. I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? I'm on the roof. I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. <sighs> okay. Get to the high ground and take some shots. What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Nice. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. The northwest side. Should be right up here. Yep. You've got a good vantage. Now use it and get an image of the air system. 
what did it say? Enter the glass to hidden camera. Okay. That's it. Take the shot and we're finished. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. <laughs> Will do. All right, let's get out of here. What a freaking lunatic, dude. I've always said this before in like some of my videos, like when you play these games or you see these movies where people do all these crazy shit like to rob places, that's got to influence people, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. Not me. I'm not pointing the finger at myself. I'm just, I'm just saying. The dangerous game we play. No pun intended. All right, let's get out of here. Man, will you relax? I wish I could just jump off the window, but if I did that, I'd probably die. I got bad knees, man. My wife just cheated on me. What do you want me to say? All right, let's get out of here. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. Go to the garment factory. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. You might be able to wipe the remote. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes who rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm systems linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. I'd start there. The glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Oh or if he God. is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. He's a good kid, he said. <laughs> They're robbing people. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, hmm. source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? I'm going to go for smart. I think last time when I played this uh, a while ago, I think I did loud. Um, the heist can be undertaken in two ways. One is stealth based on the other high impact. I don't know. Yeah, that's, 
Did we do smart enough? Let's go smart. Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, hmm. they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Crew members ask for a cut of the job. Fuck. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much hmm. difference. Damn. Ah, fuck. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the there person who will determine how long you get inside. That gave me a this fucking guy, cut, Ricky. man. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. That guy, 14% cut. Holy smokes. Okay, I'll go with Ricky. I'll go with Ricky. We just spoke to him anyways. Let's take a chance on him. That look good to you? Are you sure? Yeah. Mm. Great. Okay. Uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. <laughs> I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. There might be a better way to, to get more money, maybe slightly, but that's fine. Ice cars to become available in Rockstar's editors in director mode. Beans, okay. Here we go. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down. So, well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful and the risk will be high. But you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I got to start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I got to do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. That was a horrible, horrible sales pitch. The pay sucks. You might possibly die. You want in or not? Yeah. I don't know about that one, Chief. Now we got something here going on. What is this? What is going on here? Is it in the alleyway? There's no way gonna help me. Can you get out and help me, please, Mister? He's gonna die. He's all red and dribbling. I'm scared. We gotta get him to a doctor. I think. Okay, don't oh, fucking it. Oh. Yeah, oh. yeah. Oh. Yes, oh. that, Whoa! Yo, that's oh. so fucked up. Oh my god. <laughs> that fucking little biatch. I was about to do it with so much kindness. Out of my heart. Unbelievable. I'm trying to locate that equipment. It's going to take some time before we're ready to go. Through shopping. Uh, spend your last few moments of retirement with your family. Okay, that's probably why we have to go over here to Michael's. Dude, that was fucking hilarious. That's so rock star. That's just like some of those like stranger encounters that we had in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. When we uh, played it on PC a while back. That was awesome. That was awesome. Great cops. Fucking beautiful. I just ran somebody over. I'm being kind of looked for by the cops, all right? Everything's fine, though. Everything's totally fine. Do you even have a penis? Or are you one of those hermaphrodites born without genitals? 
tricks up our sleeves, huh? Same. Just a nightclub singer with a broken heart. I still love you, Tony. Hold it yourself. You're in over your head, and you're up there. Damn. Jimmy! God damn it. The fuck you doing? Nothing. Really? Because I keep hearing a math for that this, a cop that. Go away. What? You go watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you! What the fuck? You disrespectful little asshole! I can't believe you did that! That's my TV! You don't talk to me like that! I can't believe you... Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole! Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah! No! I just... I want you to do something besides sit there eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. <laughs> bike ride, then. Bike ride. You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. <sighs> Fuck me. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. Oh, God. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh! This man's got yeah, problems. You didn't even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. If I'm hanging with you, I'm listening to my music. Fuck yeah, I'm a jam. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnapped. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm going to let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation <laughs> left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway... I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. <laughs> this game is awesome. Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. All right, I'm gonna go for... I like this green one. This is cool. Yo, thanks. If I make it to the end of the pier first, you're gonna buy me a big-ass new flat screen. Race Jimmy to the pier. Apply the, the front pier. brake. Fine. But if you lose, you're gonna do something with your life. <laughs> Give it up, Dad. You've gone to sea. This In this man. kind of condition, a triathlon would kill you. This hurts so, so much, but I don't care. You bike a few more miles, we might be able to squeeze you into some skinny jeans. The boardwalk ain't big enough for the both of us. I mean, like, literally, it isn't. We're both kind of big. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, I'm about to pass out. This... When I wake up, please let me.
let this nightmare be over! Hey, don't they have fitness video games you can play now? If you like the beach so much, bury yourself out here! Come on, Jim! Keep pushing! My lungs are burning! But humiliating you makes it all worthwhile! My lungs it's are burning. It's not the winning, James. It's the taking part that counts. <laughs> My body isn't meant to work like this, but I'm making it to beat you. Oh shit! Wow! <laughs> Live animal, man. Hold on, man. Oh, I'm gonna catch up real quick. Fuck. Ain't gonna put me oh, off my oh, stride. Oh, 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 I'm not gonna be able to stop. Now, let me think. What am I going to do with all that spare TV money? Oh, God. What do you want, Brad? <laughs> oh, shit. This oh, game is so stupid. Hey, man, what's up? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm sorry. Oh, God. I'm going to choke here. Oh, my God. All right. We're at the pier. Come on, Giselle. Burning, but humiliating you makes it all worthwhile. What, what's the nickname he gave himself? Was it Jizzle? Giselle? I, for, I forgot what he told Franklin on the last episode. It was freaking hilarious. Look at that. Look at that stoppy. You saw that stoppy, bro? No way. Woo. Eat a shit sandwich. Ah. Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis <laughs> bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat? That makes yours look like a refugee raft? <laughs> you know the kind of boat. The one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her mm. pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Look, if you do ah! go... It happens every single time. Oh my god. Dive beneath the surface. Swimming will also improve your general stamina. Make sure we don't get bit by any sharks here. We stay underwater for too long or start to drown. <sighs> This is such a big deal. Like, all this was doable in the PlayStation 3. Like, what a. This game was so ahead of its time. And I honestly feel like that's why it's lasted so long. Because it was truly ahead of its time. It's just. This is a PlayStation 3 game. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Plus, we're taking you out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. <laughs> what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her bad, Mr. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Let's go. If those walls could talk. You think I do it? Hey, if whoa. those walls hey, could talk. Hey, what are you doing? Hey! Oh, hey. Gosh, man! I like him! What's the problem? You're such a jerk! Come on! Dad, you dumbass, these guys are serious! Yeah, well, so 
am I? Go to the scene of my fucking boat! Oh, motherfuckers! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Oh my god. Shit! They're coming after us! Go into the outlet! Oh shit! down here who the fuck are these people oh you know tv people celebs serious drug dealers well since when the tv people and drug dealers start hanging out come on dad it's los santos you're going to hit me you psychos go go keep going it's fucking hilarious man if those walls could talk Drive us home. You ruined my life. Don't mind me. I've got a couple of, you know, gunshots in my chest. It's fine. You know, dad's okay. You know, totally fine. Doing in Davis. <laughs> and that's the family quality time Lester was talking about. I love how you can see the sweat on his back. Rathalon is now available. What do you mean she's a he? Just trying to hang on until tomorrow. Oh, good. Fuck, dude. Not cool. What up, fellas? Alright, so what do we have here? Let's take a look at the map. Huh. Bug stars hey, pest control look, have some vans as a, a, so excuse me at their warehouse in Port of Los Santos. There's security in the ports, so go in quiet around the back or hit them hard and fast. All right, steal and deliver a bug star van. All right, let's go through the back. I think we can go through the back. Yeah. 
This might not work out. We might have to kill some people regardless. But oh well. Look, there's a ladder up top. Is there something if I go on the ladder? I've never taken this ladder up there. Let me see. Curious to know. Interesting. inspectors <laughs> all right so we're just gonna go down here pregnant bugs, Check. Pregnant bugs. <laughs> oh my God. hydrogen cyanide god forbid we gotta kill some bugs check i forgot how to do the takedown more bed bug larvae can't have enough of that stuff chizek there we go. Chizak. Chizak, pal. All right. That has got to be the smoothest I've ever done that. Very nice. Very freaking nice. The back door is bothering me, bro. Seriously. There we go. Thank you. Damn, should I take this? I probably should have take that. That that just that that's a little bit too risky. I fuck around and mess up the van and fail the mission. That would be really stupid. All right, here we go. Uh. Now all we need is the uh, the suits. You should be a okay. You gotta deliver this to Lester, right? I think that's where we're going. Surprised he hasn't called anyone. You know what? Grand Theft Auto game was surprisingly really freaking good. Um, well, not the game, but the DLC. The the GTA 4 DLC is really really good. Like really good. And I played GTA 4 on console. I regret not playing it on PC because the game on PC looks really nice. There we go. I think we're almost there, guys. And here, like all this dead time when you're traveling or driving from one place to another. That's the point of the radio, so it can entertain you. But unfortunately, we can't put on the radio. So I have to just keep talking and hopefully not bore you to death. <laughs> Excellent. And we got the bug car. Now uh, what? Phone call. All right, Lester, we got a pest control van. Good, I've got a line on the knockout gas. It's made in some lab on the coast, but two shipments a day come through the city from the northeast, taking it to the airport. All right, I'll see if I can jump one. HS, okay, where's HS? Here we go. Ah, look at this. It'd be hilarious if I just take the van now. <laughs> Do this with the van and... It'd be funny. No? Okay. All right, I'm gonna take... Uh, Sorry, this guy's boy, car. This. Sorry, pal. There's a car I gotta intercept. You understand? I'll, I'll return it back. Now, whether it's gonna be in great condition or not, I can't guarantee that. Matter of fact, I don't even think I can return it back. Really, dude? Fuck. Oh, All right. Dude. Pull over right now. Holy All right. Oh. 
already got the cargo, right? It's on the ground. That was probably a stupid idea because now I got the cops on me. Oh my god. We're in the middle of the fucking highway, man. Let me get the car. Hurry up. Fuck. You're coming with me. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. My health. My health, dude. Oh, my God. Holy smokes. Oh, my God. That freaking passenger kicked the shit out of me. She just kicked me out of the fucking driver's seat. Oh my god. Let's make a right here instead. Dude, that was fucking hilarious. <laughs> I'm like, alright, fine, we got a new car, then BAM! Hello? I thought she was coming with, you know? She just kicked the crap out of me. All right, drop off the BZ grenades at the garment factory. There we go. The cops are gone. We've got the granadas. And we're good. Is it over at Lester's again? Fuck. And I'm getting sick and tired of this, Lester. Shit, man. Lose the cops. What? For what, dude? Are you fucking insane? Lose the cops for what? Are you serious right now? Come on, dude. They're coming here. They're coming here. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Maybe we're still at a state where we can get seen by the cops. I don't know what the heck happened there. <clears throat> we good? Nice. Up the case. Call Lester up. Hey, Lest. I got the good night guess. That's everything we need. I'll put out word that the score is ready to go. Okay, so do we do the mission automatically? I think it just starts, right? Now we all know why we're here. We've got a store to take. The plan is simple, elegant. Listen to Lester, pay attention to the information he gives you and we'll all make a buck. If things go bad, you know the drill. This wasn't organized. We don't know each other. We got caught up in a robbery and acted in self-defense. But it's not going to be an issue because everything's going to go just fine. The, um, 
the uh, alarm system is easy. Now, if I didn't need to be running things, I could have it offline myself, no problem, but uh, you should be able to get us a pretty decent window. How decent depends on the job you do. Now, uh, once it's down, you signal Michael, he makes the call. Things look good. We should be able to drop a present right through the air vent on the roof. Everybody goes to sleep, no problem. We take our time. If we run into trouble, we move quickly and with force. Any questions? No? Mm. Let's go. Frank, you're with me. Ricky, I hope you can manage the truck with the bikes. Gus, Kareem, you got the van. Yeah, I need health, man. Shit. <clears throat> See you on Little Portolo, people. Initials only from here on out. Mm. I'll drive. That's what you're paying me for. Waiting on you, this. kids. Go to the jewelry store. Just so fucking sick. Mission's always been sick. All right, you got it down? I got it. Because you use too much gas on these guys, you'll kill them. Well, shit, don't blame me the way these canisters is <laughs> mixed. Just be careful. Yeah, okay. Listen, I stuck my neck out for you here. Man, you don't need to tell me that shit again. I got faith in you, F, but you're unproven. Unproven? For real? So I didn't prove myself when I jumped off the back of that yacht on the highway, huh? Yeah, but these guys don't know you. They see some gangbanger with a happy trigger for you. They got money and their freedom on the line. I ain't gonna fuck this up, man. Good. I got enough shit to worry about. So what kind of people we working with, man? Don't worry about the crew. Worry about yourself. Look, homie, I'm gonna look after my shit. It's just I'm curious. Well, the guy coming inside with me is tough. The driver and hacker, they ain't so good. But you know how much of Madrazo's money am I meant to give away, huh? See, it sounds reasonable. Yeah, we'll find out just how reasonable in a couple hours. The more your crew members, uh, the more you use your crew members, the more their skills will improve. Their cut will not change. All right, this is it up there. There's a way through the site up to the roof. Man, we went over this. I'm cool. All right, so we're going to leave it here. All right, when the gas is in the ventilation system, give us the word. For sure, man. I got it. All right, so go to the roof. Totally looked the part. <laughs> Excuse me. Exterminator. Hey, there ain't no one around. That suits us. Come on, get up to the roof. See, there was a health kit up there. I thought, damn, if I would, I'd be playing with Michael, I'd probably be able to get it, but that's fine. Hey, shoot! All right, so now we got to go to the vent <clears throat> that we saw and take a picture of. Big one up there. <laughs> oh, God. What the hell, Frank? Lynn? Frank to the Lynn? Lynn Frank? Almost no. there. We're in position, waiting on your signal. Just got to get where I can throw this. All right, so we have to go to the same spot we took the picture from. Oh, stamina up. Nice. All right. I got an angle. Oh, God. What's taking you? Man, just give me a minute. Damn, not yet. Hold on. That didn't go in, man. Get in there. there we go. That was it. They going out. You love her. Well, I, I love her a lot. I just, I wasn't thinking it was. Well, think about it like this. I mean, I always say that. <laughs> I told them to fix that goddamn AC. What's going on? Go. Let's do this. Come on. I got this cabinet here. Let's go. 
Steal the jewelry. Hurry up. No. Come on, come on, come on. Don't stay in there too long, okay? This alarm is gonna go at some point. You gotta come. be kidding me. On, Why did I employ a hacker who can't run antivirus software? Shit, um, uh, okay, the alarm hasn't gone off yet. We ain't hit the target yet. Keep going. Oh my god. Maybe 30 seconds left. Yo, this is nerve wracking. Keep it up. You better not be paced. Keep it up. Keep moving quick. You're doing great. Come on, come on, come on. We got nice stones in this joint. Get out the fuck. Here we go. Ten. Um, nine. Um, eight. Seven. Six. Ah, ah, five. Coast is clear. If we move now, man. Yo, so for the last time, move it. Now get the fuck out my face. Oh. <laughs> you forget a thousand things every day, pal. Make sure this is one of them. I'll see you at the river. Go. It's go time. Oh, Stick God. Me, Here we go. You're driving us Franklin, right? I'm driving blind yeah. back here. Hey, ain't the driver meant to be telling us where to go? You crackhead! Oh, hey, uh. oh my god. No. This is why we don't really need a good driver, I guess. I mean, we have Franklin. He's good enough. Kareem, you the driver? Shit, where we going? Woo. I can do with some directions, Kareem. Headlights on now. Yo, let's okay. go. Hold on. I keep going through here. But I didn't know about the split up here. Oh. If I know about the mud, I might have chosen a different bike. Hey, Kareem. These the wrong bikes to be using down here. Couldn't you have got us some scramblers? You asked for bikes. I got fast bikes. I can't believe it. Oh my god. No one said scramblers. I hope I'm guessing right. Oh my god. Shit. I don't want to fuck this up. Oh my god. <laughs> this is crazy, dude. I can't take much more of this. You got it, baby. Stay focused. The truck better be here. Yikes. This is an insane fucking heist if you think about it. Imagine doing this shit in real life. This is nuts. Shit, man, we screwed. Oh god. Hang in there, boys. I got this covered. Stop at the end of the river, get the bikes in the truck. Yeah, come on, get in. Lester's around the corner at the lockup. Through uh, gain experience with each heist you take uh, them on, their skill will improve with each job completed. 
And the cops are not going to recognize this big ass truck? I mean, come on, let's be real here, bro. Oh, fuck, man. I thought I was going to be stuck to that bike. Yeah, I thought you were going to be stuck under a cop car. There got to be more dudes waiting around that way. We did not just get away with that shit, did we? You know what? I hmm. think we did. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, we did it, baby. We <laughs> did it. Yeah, we did it. You know what I'm saying? You guys got to join my herd. Holla! I think I found my new calling, bros. That's it. Put it in the bay. Call your gym guy, Lesty baby, because we got merchandise. <laughs> what a cool mission, bro. Fuck. All right, people. We need to split up. They're going to be looking for a crew. I'll wire your cuts when the rocks have been sold. That shit was crazy, dog. So what now? We get out of here. Keep our heads down. Hey, you did good, kid. What'd I tell you, Lester, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, look, everybody take off. Hey, Franklin. Listen, Lester and I got some things we gotta clean up. I want you to stop by the house a little later on. We'll celebrate, all right? All right. Okay. <laughs> huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. We're back in action. She. That's a dope-ass mission, bro. That is a dope mission. I don't care if you got money now. Don't you get it? That ain't what I was looking for. Not then, not now, not ever. I know it ain't important. Just let me take you somewhere nice, all right? Where are you? <laughs> uh, are you in a strip club? Grow up. Stop looking for the easy way. Tanisha, I gotta go, all right? Uh, I, I'm gonna change, I promise. You won't even recognize me. Now we have Lester's contact. Meet me at my place. Your code will be in your account as soon as Lester's done with some creative accounting. Come on, baby. The girls on my block call me tribal. All right, this shit. Let's see what you're working with, baby. This way, sweetie. Come on, sweetie. All right, girl. Damn, girl. Slow it down for a player. The premium lounge. Oh God, no, we can't show this. Yeah, I couldn't actually include that in the video. That was a little bit rated uh, and for mature, more than I thought it would be. All right, just leave it at that. Leave it as a secret. All right, so we can now go to, we can now go to Michael's house. Hmm. We also have, before we go to Michael's house, we have got there's something here that I've been wanting to check out. I love this car, dude. It's so Franklin, you know? It fits him so well. Oh, this trick. Hey, boo! I knew you couldn't stay away. What's going on, man? Time. Do you ever clean your raggedy bitch ass up? <laughs> Fuck you, Lamar. I mean, Franklin or whatever. <laughs> Everybody on the block knows you gone on vine wood and shit. Well, shit, if going vine wood means I ain't hitting the pipe like 1992, then shit, I'm guilty as charged. Punk ass. What? Bitch ass. Excuse me? <laughs> Look. I'm sorry, but where's your love for the hood? JB ain't doing good. He needs help. We need your help, nigga. We gonna lose everything. All right. Shit. What do I gotta do? Same as before, boo. A little help with the tow truck. Nothing for a real man like you. All right. You just get yourself together. Your ass done went crazy. Gosh. All right, so get to the tow truck again. I don't know if I ever did this one. If it was mandatory. You never could say no to me, Franklin Clinton. I ain't so cracked out I don't remember that night behind the burger shot. Not this again. What, we was like 13? But you was a man after that night. Damn, every time with this shit. And nothing even happened. It's all good, baby. I know that wound ain't healed. <laughs> That's our truck. You know the drill. All right, let's go ahead no and do way. this. You gotta hurry your ass up, Tanya. Come on now. Dispatch, what 
you got? 10-4. We got an SUV in a handicapped spot without a sticker. It's a lucky plucker and little soul. Do you copy? You know I don't copy. I'm an original. <laughs> yeah, we got you. JB still sick. Man, you sure you need me? Because you look like you know what you doing. One, I can't drive. And two, this ain't no work for a lady. Oh, you really fighting the feminist cause there, ain't you, Tiny? Like your aunt, you mean? I saw her fake jogging the other day, chanting some whacked out nonsense. That bitch is crazy. Yeah, that we can't agree on. And I got qualifications, honey. <laughs> like hell you do. I got a certificate in cosmology. You never seen my nails. <laughs> what, you going into space now? You always <laughs> did think you were so clever. Remember Davis High? You didn't learn shit at that school. And <laughs> you got your math on the corner, Dave. Go to the illegally parked car. I think we have done this one, actually. I don't know. Sometimes I play these missions and then I'll forget what they were all about. And then it's, as I'm doing them, they'll just come back to me. Oh, hell. Sorry. Illegally parked car. Fantastic. We're on, boo. Let's move it out. Let's go. Look at the guy there. <laughs> Is that the guy? That'd be awesome. Oh, this shit doesn't have a horn, man. This ain't a job for making new friends, is it? I thought you been into some repo work. Yeah, that's true. Same shit, but nicer cars. It's an honest dollar, and there ain't many of those around. An honest dollar that I ain't seen yet? Man, JB need to get his head straight. JB's going through a hard time. A hard time sitting on his ass smoking crack? I gotta keep his hours up. Word is they gonna sell the business. A new owner ain't good news for the drivers with no papers. Mm. JB sold his social for a piece two years back. I see the problem, but I just don't see that as mine. You too good to cover a brother now? I'm here, ain't I? I've been covering that brother for 20 years. All right. I don't remember, again, if this is a mandatory mission. Doesn't matter. The dialogue is worth it. It's always fine. We'll park up in here. Drop it in the marked area. Same as before. Shit. I'll make it up to you, Franklin. You know <laughs> I will. See you round. Another favor. All right, guys. So I think we're going to call it quits here. Reason being is because we're getting to the point in the story where the next very important character is going to be arriving on the scene. And I really, I really think that we should dedicate that episode to that particular character. If you know, you know. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys uh, would like to see more Grand Theft Auto 5 enhanced remastered PS5, whatever we're calling it, just drop a like on the video. And uh, as always, catch you later.